I'm a mom. I've been a mom for eight years now. I've, I've kind of done everything, right? So like, I've done dental, I've done bartending. I just like to try new things. And right now, I'm in a spot in my life where I'm at a tattoo shop. So it started really young, like 11, 12. It started with alcohol. And then around like 15, 16, it was alcohol and cocaine. And that was mostly my adulthood up until I was about 25. And that's when I found heroin. It was the furthest thing from my mind. It was very sudden. It got really bad, like to the point where I had nothing left, right? Like I needed to go to treatment when I was 27. I'm 31 now. I almost have a year clean and sober now, but it's taken me three years to do that. It's, it's been a long journey. I went to one place before. I only stayed for a couple days. It was too bare. It was bare. There was no life to it. So I came here, stayed here a couple weeks, left. I think it was maybe a couple weeks later that I relapsed and I did that a few times and I stayed here almost two years. There's just something different about this place. It's, it's like home, which sounds weird, but it is, right? And they make it so that the environment is safe and comfortable. It is a business and some people treat it like that. Seven Summit does not, like this is family. And I've made friends, like lifelong friends here. They're all just so great. I love them all. So they do yoga. Um, Candy's amazing, I love her. They do massage therapy, craniosacral. Yeah, absolutely. It's like a spiritual sort of, I don't even know how to describe it. It's just amazing. Joel's probably one of the reasons why I keep coming back. He was a stranger. Like, why does a stranger want to help me? Um, and he, he's just a beautiful person. If you're struggling with addiction and you feel hopeless, trust me, there's hope. And it's right here at Seven Summit Pathways. They helped me, and if I can do it, anybody can.